this is something for today. We got 20 packs of overtime wave two. I've actually got even more. Uh, let's get this here. I got 40 packs, but I'll be splitting it up into two videos just because I don't have enough memory space on my phone. So let us begin. Overtime wave two. Here's the stuff you can get. You know, typical sort of stuff. There are photo variations. I've been wondering about that, and there are photo variations, so I'll we'll keep an eye out for those, see if any, any come out. So, let us begin. Kyle Palmieri, there's the base. I'm sure you've all seen him by now. The back, JD Comfer. A rookie of Bowen Pyram. I'm not sure if Lafreniere has a base rookie in this. I don't think so. But he does have one of these next in line. There's a Bowen Pyram. I know that because I pulled one, so. Next pack. See if we can get any autographs or numbered cards. A numbered uh, insert would be nice because those are pretty tough. And they're uh, short prints as well, so. That would be very nice. Lafreniere autograph. Uh, next in line insert. That'd be cool. Michael Amadio. Seth Jones. Pecorine. And Pierre Oliver Joseph next in line. So they, these uh, Wave 2, I, they come with Series 2 and maybe SP Game Used and a few other products. I don't know. I didn't obviously didn't open any SP Game Used. I don't plan on it. That stuff sucks. Uh, Dan Vladar, Vladar, I don't know how you say his name, but he's supposed to be pretty good. Not a rookie, by the way. His uh, stuff's, I believe, in 1920. Beauvillier, hey, that's not bad. Another good uh, goaltender prospect. Vitek Vanacek, autograph. That's not bad. Autographs are like one in 24 packs or something like that, so... That's cool. Rookie autograph of Vitek Vanacek and Liam Foodie. I wonder if that's a, a rare one. I think the overtime autographs are like Group A, Group B, you know, that sort of thing. So, maybe that uh, Vanacek is rare. Dubé, Mueller, Kirby Dak, Nick Robertson. Next in line. Pretty cool looking cards. I like those uh, better than the, uh, what are they, uh, whatever, I forget what they're called. In the, uh, Overtime Wave 1, Sonny Milano, Oliver Bjorkstrand, Victor Rask, and a Lafreniere next in line. An ugly photo shoot picture. Upper Deck, for whatever reason, still using Lafreniere photo shoot pictures. Even though he's been playing for quite a while. Uh, the first, I know SP Authentic doesn't use uh, photo shoot pictures, so that should be the first product without. Um, Lano Bjorkstrand is it? No, it's not Victor Rask. It's a Byron Blue. That's not bad. Same two base cards to start off the pack. The last one, Byron Blue. It's pretty good. And uh, Jason Robertson. Possible Calder winner. Next in line. He's also pretty good. Because no one's really talking about him because he's on the stars and not many people care about the stars. Tyler Mott. Dylan Dubé is a numbered card of Brendan Hagel. Red out of 99. 76 and 99. Rookie card. That's not too bad either. He's playing. So. There's a key for Bellows. Next in line. Each pack will have one of those next in lines. Not every pack has an insert or a parallel or autograph, whatever, but Yamamoto, yeah, Brown, Josh Bailey, another key for Bellows. Next in line. These overtime cards, I've mentioned this before, they actually sell somewhat well. There seems to be a, some demand for these. I'm sure there's set collectors. Got another autograph, as you can see, the gold, so save that for last. Let's see what that will be. I don't know the autograph checklist for uh, 
wave two. So, Zach White Cloud, Marino, Shane Bowers over time, and another Lafren year next in line. I bought like, what, 10 Shane Bowers young guns for like, what, 50 cents on Palm C. Because he was a first round pick, but he's not producing in the AHL at all, so at least I didn't spend uh, too much money on his stuff. Pecorine, Adam Fox, Josh Bailey Blue, and a Josh Norris next in line. You never know. Shane Bowers could pick it up, but right now, uh, people's uh, hopes on him are not high. Phil Myers, Cock and Yemi, Tyler Johnson Blue, and there's another Shane Bowers next in line. The uh, collation in these overtime packs, typically not the greatest. It's kind of understandable, though. I don't know why. I, I can understand why Upper Deck wouldn't waste their time to be a collation on these uh, promo packs that people are going to get typically, like, what? A maximum of, like, two or three per purchase, unless they're buying case upon case. So Robert Hag, Jordan Stahl, Michael Amadio. Uh, blue. Tyler Benson next in line. The condition on these seems to be pretty good so far. I haven't noticed anything out of whack, so. Brandon Hagel, rookie. Panic. Jake Gardner. Vitaly Kravtsov next in line. He's not producing much either, but we'll see. The uh, Rangers rookies are not doing so well. The high picks as of late. Kravtsov, Lafreniere, although he's picking it up. A bit. Kako. Y'all know what happened with Leas Anderson. Alexiev, Panic, Tyler Mott, Blue. And then Connor Ingram next in line. We'll see. The Rangers, uh. I don't know. They don't seem to be doing too well with their prospects that they're developing within their system. That is, Adam Fox has done well because uh, he developed in the uh, college, right? So, but guys that were in their AHL system or went straight to the team don't seem to be doing all that good. Yamamoto, Brown, Sammy Niku, Blue, and Jason Robertson next in line. Maybe it's their coach. I've seen a lot of Rangers fans complaining about David Quinn or whatever his name is. Don't seem to be fond of him. Paling. Paling. Arlamov and Wallman. Paling hasn't even played this year, I don't think. And Alexander True next in line. The second coming of Fabian Brunstrom, Paling is. Or maybe... Yamamoto, another Dustin Brown. Got another autograph here. It's a rookie, looks like a shark of Nikolai. I think it's Nitsov. I forget how to say this guy's name, but. Yeah, another autograph. So that's three autographs. And uh, Philip Kurashev next in line. So pretty good for the first 20 packs. Let's see if anything else can come out of these last two, and then we'll get on to the last. Nick Robertson, Rookie Huberdo, Anna Fox Blue, Shane Bowers next in line. John Marino, uh, Nitsov Rookie, Panic Blue, and Ole Ulevi next in line. Right, on to the last one with the autograph. So, Huberto, Sonny Milano, William Foody, and, oh, that's pretty good, Nick Robertson, rookie autograph. A lot of Leafs fans uh, were fans of this guy, so that's pretty good. His young gun's like, what, 15 bucks? So I don't know what this would go for, but it kind of gives you an idea of what it may sell for. So that was pretty good for a 
three packs, only one numbered card, but three auto, or not three packs, 20 packs. Uh, one numbered card, three autographs though, so that was pretty good. Nice stack of stuff, some base. Go on to the next 20 packs, so keep an eye out for that. That's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.